Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. You can store virtually any type of electronic information in a notebook, including text, graphics, photos, web pages, audio clips, video clips, Excel spreadsheets, and hyperlinks. When you insert content into your notebook pages, each piece of information exists within a note container. A note container consists of a frame with a move handle and a resizing handle. Each object you place into the note container, such as text and images, has an object selector that appears to its left. The frame of the active note container will be visible, but the frames around the other containers on the page are not. Hovering your mouse pointer over a container will display its frame. Hovering your mouse over the content of a note container will display the object's container and its selector, which we will discuss later. To insert a note container on a page, click into the page in the location where you want the container to appear. Then type the text or paste the content that you have copied from another location. You can continue adding other note containers in this same manner. If you click too closely underneath an existing note container, OneNote may place the insertion marker into the bottom of the note container above it. Typing at this point would simply add your text to the existing container. This is helpful when you want to continue adding text to the same note container. However, to create a separate note container, click further down in the page and away from the container above, or simply click to the right of the existing container to create a separate container, and then move the new container underneath the existing container. The most basic and common type of information that can be entered into a note container is text. You can enter text by typing it directly into the container or by pasting it in from a different source. As you type, OneNote will automatically grow the container to accommodate the information. You can resize the container horizontally by hovering your mouse pointer over the right side of the container until you see a double pointed arrow appear. Simply click and drag when you see that arrow to resize the container horizontally. You can also move a note container to another location on the page by hovering your mouse pointer over the top edge of the container until you see a four-pointed arrow appear. Click and drag when you see that arrow appear to move the container to a new location in the page. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.